Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, the last time I tried to vlog, it was a complete fail. Because I tried to do a shop with me. I just dropped Brian off his charger and stuff. And I just left Ethan at um, school. Um, and then Brian comes to work at about 5.45 every morning. So, I always get up and bring him to work. My skin looks real good. Probably because my skincare is still fresh. So, anyways, I wanted to go to Target while I didn't have to have the boys with me. And I want to do a clean with me. And I want to finally try out our dishwasher because I haven't tried it since we lived in this house. I just used the dishwasher to dry the dishes. Really, I wash my hand and time in the sink. But sometimes that gets a little overwhelming for me, so I'd like the option to use the dishwasher. So I'm going to try that out today. And so yeah, I'm headed to Target right now. I have some coupons for some makeup. I have some manufacturer's coupons that I clip out of the stuff that comes in the mail. And then I have some Target Circle coupons. I need to get back on Target Circle and see if I can find a dishwasher liquid on sale. We also need hand soap and coffee creamer. So, moral of the story is I'm going to Target for a whole bunch of stuff that I don't need and some stuff that I do right now. So, you guys can join me. to see if this one has the coffee creamer as soon as I get in there. If not, I'm going to go get the boys and then we'll head to the big Target that has the grocery side because this one close to my house doesn't have the grocery side, but they do have like necessities. So if this one doesn't have the, the creamer that I have a coupon for, we're not getting it. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and go in. And I couldn't find a coupon for a dishwasher detergent that I would like because I'm really trying to go more like natural but all they had is cascade so I'll see what I can find I also need hand soap I don't know if I already told you guys that but I need hand soap <laughs> yeah, I want need a car wash so bad but I hate washing it during the week because Brian's job is surrounded by dirt roads so I'll wash it on Saturday okay so I oh, ended up only getting two things that I didn't need and I wasn't gonna get anything that I didn't need. I was only gonna get all the soaps. But when I was going back to put all the makeup back, I've seen that a cover girl was like, buy one, get one 25% off. And I was like, ooh, well, then I could stack these coupons on there. But it only let me do, it only let me do one coupon because it takes 25% off the lowest priced item. So obviously the foundation was more expensive. So it let me do the foundation coupon but I guess, I don't know. I don't know how the coupons worked. But What would Lizzie do do this last year? And I just thought that it was the cutest thing and the sweetest thing. 
so i don't order very many packages you guys know that but i do want to order a few more things so i thought i'd just put this out for our mailman because he has been delivering like our monthly subscription boxes all year and stuff like that so yeah i think it's a very good idea sorry my the outside of my house is so dirty i live in west texas and it's dirty <laughs> Let me show you what I got. So I got, like I said, I got the little hand soaps. Obviously, I'm gonna put one in Toy's bathroom, one in our bathroom. I have one in the kitchen. It's the Mrs. Myers brand. This is another natural brand that Target has. And then I got the coffee creamer. And then, ah, like I said, I ended up getting the foundation. And then the mascara. These little soaps smell really good. Like, I could smell them the entire time. So, this only comes with 16 and it's expensive. So, obviously, I won't be using the dishwasher all the time. But, um, I'm actually going to wash dishes by hand. Hush! I'm actually going to wash dishes by hand today. And then just, um, run the dishwasher just with one of these in there. Just to clean it out. Because, yeah, I feel like it's nasty in there before I use it. But, yeah. I'm gonna run, wash dishes, run one of these, and then you guys can clean with me. I'm about to get the boys up and fed and stuff.
Yeah, it took me roughly about two hours. So what I wanted to do, I guess, was just show you guys around because you guys always see like bits and pieces here and there and whatnot. So let me actually take this down because it doesn't go there. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys around. You walk in the front door like this is what you see, obviously. So kitchen, living room, excuse my child in his underwear, he peed on himself. Then you walk down the hallway and you have the laundry room right here. And then this first room is our guest room. All of those are blessings. So I'm gonna block those for my family that's watching. This is where Ethan has been sleeping until we get him a bunk bed, but I have like my home workout stuff in here and whatnot. But ultimately it's just a guest room. Who else gets satisfied by carpet marks? I already messed it up right there when I was hanging up jackets. And then this is the boys' bathroom. This is supposed to be inside the shower. So yeah, this is the boys' bathroom. And then door to the backyard. And then this is the boys' room. So like I said, once we get bunk beds, we'll keep this one, get rid of that one. Bunk beds will probably go over there. So yeah, this is the boys' room. Then you come all the way to the back. And how many of you were like, dang, she's vacuuming forever? Dude, it's because our room is massive. Like, I threw this chair in here to take up some space. That's why the desk is in here. Makeup recording corner over there, which you guys have seen many times. And then that's my side of the bed. I got all my books over there. And then, obviously, Brian's side. He has his CPAP machine, the fan, and then his diploma. I don't know where my diploma is. Then a little bear. And then you got our bathroom. <laughs> yeah. And then I have a little Paris thing up there that I need to fix because Brian wanted to do Paris theme. So, yeah. This is our room. Oh. And then our closet. Brian's shoes are messed up, which I keep fixing over and over. So, yeah, the next time you guys see me and my children, we will be decent and cleaned up. So my hair is fixed. All I did was really just change my shirts. I left the same sweats on. My shirt had toothpaste on it and everything else. I have on just sweats and like this croppish top shirt. I say croppish top because it never shows my belly because I'm not about that life. My body ain't about that life. My body ain't built for that life. So, <laughs> yeah, anytime I wear a crappie top, it always meets or it goes a little bit below my actual waistband. So, what I'm going to do right now is make a list for the store tomorrow. Because I don't want to go over. I've been doing really good at budgeting. So, I don't want to go over. So, I'm about to make a list for what we need and things like that. Um, I am still gonna buy some more coffee creamer because we drink a lot of coffee. Those, there's just certain things that I constantly buy, regardless whether we have it or not, just because the fear of running out and then not having the money later. Like, I don't know, I have that mindset. Brian said I need to break it because we're not gonna run out of money. And we have been very blessed this year, so I need to kind of get out of that mindset, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start making that list and look at Kim trying to run away with my wallet. <laughs> Anyways, uh, <laughs> my towels just finally got out the dryer, so I'm about to fold them. Hey guys, so I never ended yesterday's vlog, so I decided I will just vlog today too. And yeah, so I'm putting up the dishes right now, it's 6.45. I've already gotten ready and taken Brian to work. So I'm gonna put up these dishes, run the dishwasher so it can clean itself, so that way I can start using it. And then I get the boys ready, and then I just asked Brian if it was okay. Me and the boys went on a little breakfast date, so. I'm gonna go ahead, put up these dishes, and then 
yeah put up these dishes and you, you guys know you know so yeah we will just go ahead and get that done I needed to add a couple of things to my grocery list um cough drops medicine for me if you can hear me and then um batteries because Brian's game remotes are like going crazy right now. Okay, so yeah, let's go ahead and start putting up these dishes. I didn't talk through any of that because this dishwasher is super duper loud. And that's because I have it on a normal setting. It's not like pots and pans or anything. So what I'm gonna do, I just took my my greens that has, let me read it to you guys. I actually have a video over my weight loss journey and what I've been doing. But basically it says, get your greens the easy and delicious way while shedding pounds and inches. Now that's something I, I can sink my teeth, you can sink your teeth into. And it says it features an all natural Slim Vance herbal blend, proven to deliver six times more weight loss and three times more waste and hip reduction. It helps you achieve a transformational weight loss without, all without caffeine or other stimulants. Packed with whole foods, fruits, veggies, and greens, enhanced with a rejuvenating blend of Adaptogenic mushrooms includes Predic X, a vegetarian, non-GMO, prebiotic, plus enzymes and immune, plus enzymes to support healthy digestion. So it says here it contains organic, organic, organic fiber blend. In inulin flaxseed, well, flaxseed, organic vegetable blend, broccoli, carrot, kale, parsley, spinach, organic fruit blend, apple, apple fiber, oh, apple, apple fiber, blueberry, black currant, antioxidant spice blend, green tea leaf extract, apple fruit extract, grape seed extract, organic ginger, organic turmeric, organic cinnamon, enzyme blend. Protease, amylase, bromelain, cellulose, lactase, papain, and lipase. So, yeah. I like it. I've, um, you're to take this, um, with cold water. Our water stays cold, even in the cabinet. And so it says one scoop. Add one scoop to six to 10 fluid ounces of water. And then you take it 30 minutes before breakfast and dinner. I haven't been taking it before dinner. I guess I should start, but yeah, I do always take it before breakfast. And if we go to the gym, I take it as soon as we get home from the gym because then usually I um, start cooking dinner and then dinner's done within 30 minutes. But it's the days that I don't go to the gym that I forget to take it before dinner. So, yeah, I feel like I've been seeing a really good change. Um, I used to wear a size 18 pants, and these are a 16 from American Eagle. Now, the first day I wore these, these legit, like, barely buttoned, and now I have a little bit of room. And the first time I wore them was actually on Thanksgiving, so not even a month later and I already have some more room. But I've also started taking this before my workouts. And you can if you don't work out, you can use this. You can take this before um or you can take this with breakfast if you don't work out. And then since it has caffeine, it's not they say not to take it before bed. But it's just a thermogenic, it helps you burn 
60% more calories, which I also feel like, guys, I'm somebody who never loses weight around my butt area, and I'm starting to lose weight there. Not that it's getting flat, but like it's actually starting to get smaller. Usually my butt just gets tight and lifted, but it always stays big. So I'm kind of really excited that my butt's losing weight, but yeah, I gotta get the boys up. I'm gonna make me an iced coffee, and then we can get going with our day. Okay guys, so I got everybody dropped off. We didn't go get donuts because Brian said we needed to wait till tomorrow. But I am getting me and him some food because I legit, I didn't like throw up everything, like all of that green juice, but I did throw up some of it because yeah, I took it way too early before eating. Um, really, I think it was my vitamin that did that to me, but yeah, I threw up took the kids to the school and to their great grandma's house and about to get me and Brian some breakfast and probably get a burrito for my sissy so I will see you guys in a minute hey guys so I just left the hospital I didn't even vlog because I was just so wrapped up in my little my little new nephew my little auntie's baby and i'll insert some pictures but now i'm headed to target to uh, go grocery shopping and then i'm gonna go to best buy to get brian his gift i'm gonna get him some airpods because he messed up his beats at the gym taking him into the steam room and he was wanting airpods so that's what Anyway, so that's what I'm going to get him and probably take them to him. <sighs> and, um, yeah, I'm going to give them to him today because we don't really celebrate Christmas. Um, that's a whole story or lesson in itself. We do, as a family, what's called Blessings Month, and then we don't do anything on Christmas Day. But I'm going to sleep, and since Brian's off, he'll probably sleep. I'm not going to cook or anything like that. So, yeah. Good stuff, good times. Can y'all see how dirty my car is, or our car is? Really need to car wash, but I have to wait till at least tomorrow to wash it. It's, y'all, I don't even look black right now. So, yeah, I'm gonna head to Target and the big Target so we can go grocery shopping, and I'll see you guys there. put my hair up as it was a mission at Target so I wanted to tell you guys um I did all my grocery shopping even like replenished some hygiene products and the total was gonna be like 278 279 somewhere around there I just remember it was like high 270s and I was like and I have Target the target circle if you don't have it go download it become a member because i'm about to tell you all the deets okay so when you get target circle you get exclusive coupons for target as well as manufacturers coupons you can get on the target app so i only try to buy obviously there's going to be some things i can't buy with the coupon but i really try to buy whatever has a coupon available that we need so, I ended up getting $20 off up front, and then I'll leave a link for the next thing down below for this app called Ibotta. And what you do is basically like you go on there and you just upload receipts and whatever items they have available, if you bought that item, you get cash back for it. And you can withdraw the money once it hits $20. So, not only did I get $20 off at uh checkout but now tomorrow once my receipt processes and stuff i will get twenty dollars cash back and then i think it goes to my paypal and then i just deposit it into my regular bank account so there's that and i'm super excited and then target now when you get the target circle app you can get cash back on future purchases as well 
So, with all of that being said, oh, this Walmart's always packed for gas. So now, with that being said, I'm about to get a lot of money back because the cash back from Target, though, you can only use at Target. But since I like to go to Target, I mean, why not? And then you can even use your Target. So, yeah. And it was like I was saying, you can only use the Target offers at Target. But if you get, like, so, it's like money. So, for instance, today I might get around, I don't know. I'll put the total up right here once I figure it out. But I'll get that much back and then I can go... Whenever the boys need diapers in an emergency or like we're in a pinch for something, I can go to Target and get stuff for free. Last time I went to Target, I bought makeup and I only had to pay $1 for it. I bought a few things. It was like two little lip kits from Profusion and my little e.l.f. eye tapes and I used my cash back that I got from Target and I only had to pay a dollar still. Yeah, it's not too shabby, so get Target Circle. I'll leave a link for Ibotta. And start saving some moolah. And if you put, I don't know if you guys have it where you're at, but if you put gas at Walmart at the Little Murphy Station, they now do rewards to where you can get money off of gas once you reach a certain amount of rewards. So that's where I put gas. Everywhere I try to shop is somewhere where they have a point system. Yeah, so yeah. I'm about to go home and take these groceries home. Blech. Well, hello same day redid my hair now it's a bun day change because i was hot now we're gonna get to put in to put in everything up so i finally finished all my running around brian's grandma said the boys can still stay over there a little bit longer never forget or you'll never guess what i did so i don't know if i told you guys yet i forgot some stuff at target that i had paid for so i have to go back to target to get that then i went to best buy to go buy the airpods they were all out and so I was looking at other headphones. Brian didn't like any of those styles. I had called them and had to ru ruin the surprise. And then as I was getting in the car, I was looking at Best Buy to see if I could just, I was just gonna order them anyway. But then as I was looking, I seen that JBL had some um, wireless pop in the air headphones. So I was like, oh, let me go back in here and see if they have them. They did, and those were only on sale for $99 original price 150 so still cheaper than the airpods original price but i mean still save a whole lot of money so yeah so now i'm just putting up the stuff that i forgot and then i need to put up all the hygiene miscellaneous stuff hey guys yeah so after that last check-in, all I really did was lay around. I shaved my face, like shaved all the peach fuzz off. And then I tried to touch up my brows and look, I'm missing a chunk. 
So right now it's just me, Brian, and two of the boys because Bryson stayed at Brian's grandma's house because he was asleep. I think he does it on purpose. I'm starting to think he does it on purpose. And then Brian's just over there watching video. TV going and then Ethan knows he's supposed to have all these trains out here but he still does built this whole track and ain't even playing with the track I wanted to show you guys this headphones I got Brian so, where'd they go so you do have to so these headphones you do have to charge the case oh, I don't know what I pushed but now they're charging so with these headphones, you do have to charge the case and then this will be portable. The case has 20 hours of charge and then the headphones themselves have four, which is not bad, I don't think anyways. So yeah, these are little headphones, I got them. How do you like them now that you played with them a little bit, babe? Really, I need to work out and see how much I really like them. Picky, picky man. But yeah. Yeah, so I'm barely headed to go get Bryson. We didn't even go to the gym. We just rested. And I think we both needed it because we're both kind of getting sick. So, yeah. It's not like we've been... We missed a lot this week. We've only gone on Monday. So, I was like, if we miss today, we have to go all weekend. Like, I can't do that. We're about to go pick up Bryson. And then I'm going to come back home and cook dinner. But it's already almost 8. So... I don't know. I'm gonna call Brian and see what he wants to do. But yeah, we're gonna head to get Bryson now. I'm just letting the car warm up because it's gotten really, really chilly. And I'm not trying to have no radiator problems. So yeah, we'll see you guys either when I'm picking up food or when I'm at home cooking is the next time you will see me. Okay, so I just got home with food. We got some chicken express, got some fried okra, some chicken strip roll. Oh, fried okra, chicken strips, a roll, and honey mustard, barbecue sauce, a couple apple pies, and then Brian got fries and fried pickles with chicken strips. So, <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and close out the vlog, and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys, but always remember that Jesus loves you more. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Mwah. <laughs>